Hello and welcome. Today we're taking a look at Spellcaster University. Just hit 1.0 here just a couple days ago, and I thought we should check it out. So, Spellcaster University by Sneaky Yak Studio it has been around for a little while. It was in early access for a couple of years, and uh, I, I neglected to check it out. Uh, I didn't really think much of it. I, I saw the... Uh, I knew about it, and uh, it just it just didn't do it for me. Um, I kind of ignored it, really, is what happened. Um, and, I, and that was a bit of a mistake, because I did not realize how much was actually here. There's a lot going on. Um, we're building a school, a, a sort of Hogwarts, essentially. Um, bringing students in, sort of selecting what uh, classes they will be select, they will be uh, teaching, what, what magical schools they will be learning. And uh, there's just a lot happening here. So anyway, <clears throat> let's check it out. I'll try to ease you into it uh, as best I can, but we'll check out a new campaign here. In Spookcast University, we'll stick with our medium difficulty. Um, I'm going to go with the shortest length because it makes things go a little quicker. Maybe we can see a bit more stuff. Um, we have different challenges as you play the game. You can change some stuff around if you wish. Uh, and we'll go with uh, a normal game here, though. Uh, this is my name of my school is, uh, is Nookwartz. The most clever of names. I know. I know what you're thinking. Uh, all right. So uh, we got to choose a coat of arms here. Oh, the ant is kind of cool. It's nothing to do with nook or warts, but uh, I kind of I kind of like the ant. Like I need a, a nice red ant. No, that's not that's not an ant. This is the ant. Um, a nice like a nice dark red ant. Yeah, yeah. Uh, with a uh, with a with a black banner behind him, and then um, maybe a little bit of uh, oh yeah something like something like that maybe. That ain't bad. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so as you start the game, it's this is kind of like a continuing campaign. We build one school, uh, and then eventually we'll go into next, to more schools throughout the map. There are more schools will pop up and more challenges and things like that. As we begin, we choose one of these spots, and each of these have different perks. You know, so we have the, like the forest, for instance. If we go there, which is where we'll be going, uh, students are a little bit poorer, which means less money coming into us. We got some werewolves around. Uh, there's a troll hanging out as well. Uh, the lake, we have a lake monster. It's also a little ways from 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 home for walking reasons. The, the village is sort of like the beginner's spot. We're gonna go with the forest though, just because it sounds it sounds exciting. So, let's build a uh, a, a magical school. Welcome to the forest, a Sylvan Citadel. Kingdom's great forests are known for their giant millennium trees. We'll be at home here. Legends say that elves used to live in these woods, but everyone knows that elves don't exist. Local population lives more simply than the rest of the kingdom, so do not expect any rich students. That whole little thing about uh, uh, elves don't exist, yeah, right. Uh, we'll be having elves showing up in our in our school. <clears throat> um, so we can go with, we get a choice. This is kind of a card-based thing, sort of. It's not like a deck build or anything, but we'll, we'll get some cards, and we're going to use those to, uh, to, to, basically they're just, we're getting cards represented in the rooms of our schools, or perks for our rooms, or, or new students, that kind of a thing. Um, so our first choice here, in building our school, is he's giving us some choices, uh, with, with what we want to begin with. Um, we've got multiple schools of magic. We have the standard deck, which gives us random things. We have a nature deck, which is for, like, nature mages, druids, and things like that. We have a light deck for the paladins, or whatever. We've got the alchemy deck for the alchemists. Uh, each actually each deck also has multiple things in there. So like for instance, the, the shadow deck has like necromancy and demonology and something else is in there. <clears throat> we'll get that in a minute. Sorry, that's a little bit confusing and overwhelming. Um, I would like to begin with a um, I'll take a stable card and a fawn card. Are we gonna go with uh, nature folks? I think it sounds like a good idea. Yeah, I want uh, some free things here. So right now before we start the game, we're all paused here. We're here at our school, which is the entrance. Uh, we have a bunch of room to build our place. So these cards, we use these to put down things for our students. Students need beds. They need a place to uh, a student's hall, and they also need a place to eat. So let's start out by putting down a hall. Uh, sure, on top there. Uh, and then we'll put in, kind of cool, we'll put in a dormitory so we can have a place to sleep. Uh, sure, we'll put it in. That doesn't seem that should, Let's put the ref, refectory there. And then the dormitory can go up on top. Hey? Uh, yeah, whatever. There we go. Okay, so now students have a place to eat, sleep, and relax, uh, which is some things we'll have to take care of here later on. <clears throat> we also need to get something for the uh, the students to learn. It's an important part of this because it's a school, right? So, thing I grabbed, the stable. So, a, student, uh, a classroom that allows students to quickly improve their beast magic skills. So, this is a classroom, and... There's multiple classrooms in the game, and whichever classrooms you have, it teaches those kinds of magic. This teaches beast magic. That so means we can start teaching some beast magic 
um, kids. Is that the word for it? Sure. It's a stable. I'm going to throw it out just to be different. I'm going to throw it like... Should we go way over here? That's a bit of a walk, isn't it? Let's like... Um, let's just set it there. There we go. Okay, so if each classroom you place, you have to have a teacher. So who's going to be our teacher? We've got uh, we got uh, Meryl MacDoll or Zachary Baynard. So they all have lots of stats. Um... Depending on their 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 uh, you know he's, she's chaotic evil he's neutral that sort of the students they like those kind of t they like the like a chaotic kid will learn better under a chaotic teacher uh, the pedagogy is how well they, they teach so you want something good for that uh, unionize means how much money they're gonna make mostly the important thing is pedagogy and these stats so she's inspiring which means students in her class have a small chance of losing a negative trait she's also relaxed which is kind of a bad thing it means kids move slow. He has Ancient Wisdom, means students learn faster around him. Also, Unbreakable means we may get attacked. Trolls and things may attack us. Uh, what's Pretentious? Pretentious increases the boredom of the character. I think this guy's kind of cool. He's got Ancient Wisdom, he's Unbreakable, his name's Zachary Baynard. Yeah, I like it. Health and sanity will come when we get attacked by things. We'll see it in a minute. Just, just hang on. So there is... Oh, <laughs> nice. So we now have a stable, which are... <clears throat> our, our teacher is going to teach over there. We don't have any students yet. We have a fawn as well. Fawn, a creature wanders the school and greatly decreases the growth rate of tiredness, hunger, and boredom uh, of nearby teachers for a long time. Um, we'll get a teacher's lounge and we'll throw the fawn in there. So here comes my old teacher. He, he's he's waddling in right now. Uh, let's get some... Uh, oh, let's get a house. We'll get some students in a minute, but we need a house first. Am I not paused? Oh, I should have paused. Whoops. All right, so let's get ourselves a new house. <clears throat> okay, so this is, you know, uh, uh, Hufflepuff. Slytherin. This is this is what we're doing here. So each of these houses, they uh, will we'll choose a name, Kiorin. Um, and we're gonna choose a. Uh, um, I'm trying to think of, of an easier way of saying this without using Hogwarts terms, and I think I can. So we're we're choosing if we wanted to choose Slytherin, they would be the Shadow Magic. And so if you, as we get kids in here, we're going to tell them where they go. So we're gonna choose a Nature Magic uh, uh, house because that's what we've got. Um, there's, there would be no shadow or alchemy, none of that. All you guys are going to be going into nature magic. And uh, each of these houses have a feature. So as we throw kids in, they may get bonus things. Oh, hey. Actually, I don't have any... I kind of like the idea of shadow magic. What if we do like a shadow and nature? Okay, shadow nature. I like it. Demons, nature, it all goes together. So this house's perk will be they have shadow magic. They also have... Child of Nature, which is learning nature magic faster. These are the perks we could do, but those are good. Um, and I want something like Evil and Green. What do we get here? Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and I want the, um, that's a good looking, but I want the background to be like, oh, how about a black tree? That makes sense? If I can click over there. Like a black tree, or maybe, maybe like a dark red tree. On a uh, on a green background, that seems that seems shadowy and uh, um, um, not naturey. Hmm. I kind of want it to be black, but I don't think it's gonna work. We can do this one like the green there, and then these will be black. I don't want to spend too much time on this, but there we go. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that kind of works. Sure, sure. So there's our evil uh, uh, druids. Okay, so what we've done is we can we now have a house. Let's bring some students in. Five students. All right, Ursula Cyril. Ursula, she's lawful neutral. We can see, uh, what was the teacher we chose? I think she was chaotic evil. Uh, she's a bit slow, so she learned a little slower. Uh, and, she, and she's a bit average on our money, which is how much money she's bringing to us. These are all our schools. So we saw beast magic, right? That's what they teach over here. Um, there's other nature magic things we can get. Herbalism. And, and druidism are the other ones we can do. But right now we do beast magic. Controlling wild creatures. Hopefully we'll find some of this demonology stuff later on in our deck. But uh, we can put her into either a general class or a, or uh, the Kyoran, the, the shadow nature class. She is an alchemy apprentice, which means she does like alchemy. So I'm going to put you in general. Also, she's a goth, which means she doesn't like light magic. Yeah, go be a general class and just learn that, uh, that, that uh, alchemy stuff. Jack of all trades, you learn everything fast. You don't like pollen. You don't like nature magic. You know, Rita, what are you doing here? All right, general magic for you. All right, Vincent, jack of all trades. He's a little aggressive. Misbehaves a bit. He's chaotic good. Uh, yeah, fine, go over there. We got a passionate. She's chatty. She slows the rating, learning rate of, of students in the same room, which is rough. 
And also misbehaves. She's also dumb. She's got money. She's got money, but she's the worst. Man. Lisa, I guess I'll take you. I, I, I can get rid of her. Toss her in the trash, but I, I guess I'll take her. Uh, another alchemy apprentice. Maybe we'll get some alchemy in here. We're going to have to hope for alchemy. Okay. So, uh, we can unpause now, and then the students will come rolling in here. And we've got some cash. we got 664 It costs us 100 bucks to draw an extra card that we can use to, to pull out new rooms. Uh, hello from the villages. We're from around here. We don't like trouble. And we're not fond of strangers. Ooh, what are you doing here? Uh, do not worry, common folk. <clears throat> we are here teaching the rule of the Church of Light, which gives us some light mana, which allows us to buy a light deck. We use mana to buy these decks, which gives us, which focuses us in the light category. Is this making sense? I hope so. All right, so we can say this is a nature mana thing. Uh, the peasants will like us a bit more. We'll see that in a second. Or we say, get out of here. Hmm. Reputation with faction Lord of Evil. Do not worry, for our school mainly trains as mages, specialized in necromancy and the summoning of powerful demons. Do not worry, common folk. Yeah, I want that one. So we gain some mana. It costs 100 mana to, to draw out of the shadow deck, which we'll see here in a second. <clears throat> oh, more students came in. All right, so we got um, <clears throat> you're courageous, old-fashioned, and aggressive. Uh, ready to fight? Yeah, you, you can go. You can go over there. Uh, we got a light. Be she's beautiful, or he? He's he's a beautiful light sleeper. He's demoralized, antisocial, uh, a bit slow. Yeah, whatever. Go over there. <clears throat> oh, hey, we got a uh, we got a creature. So you are a werewolf. You're not a human. <clears throat> you're a werewolf. You hit twice as hard once we get into fights. We'll see that. Uh, also, a big part of this, uh, the students will graduate, and. Um, and we will sort of graduate as well, moving to different schools, like I mentioned before on the map. And so we want to train these guys up and get, like, Archmages. And and we get perks for the future things. Um, can I draw this right now? No, I gotta get this first. Okay, okay. Uh, gourmet, your hunger rate is lower. You're ugly. Hyperactive a bit. Kind of dumb. Um, now you go, go be a shadow guy. You're an orphan. If the students were to die, you would not lose any prestige. There's prestige down there. That's kind of rough. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, Lawrence. Oh, uh, yeah, come on in here. You're comical. Oh, yeah? You're a bit shifty. You don't like... Oh, you are allergic to pollen. You don't like natural... Uh, you don't like nature. So I'm not going to put you in the nature class. I'll put you in the general. Okay, uh, let's draw, draw from this deck here. So, we have a choice. A couple different things. Um, this tentacle, for instance, this is a item which we can place in certain rooms. So active students in this room slightly improve their demonology and portal magic skills. We can put this in our stable, and students will still gain those those skills. Even that, you know, uh, just being around. But we also got a prison. When a teacher catches a student misbehaving, the student is sent to the prison to discourage them from doing it again while working for a while. Okay. Uh, and we have the crypt also, which teaches us necromancy. And I think we know. If you've been, if you've watched the channel more than this video, you know what we're picking. <laughs> you know what we're picking. All right, so we got a crypt. Where's the crypt gonna go? And we put it on top of the, uh, on top of the. Uh, we can put the green stuff all together. No, you know what? It's gonna go here. This is this is green and red. Yeah, shadow druids. It makes sense. So we got Fanny Shamrock. She's hawk eyed. Keeps uh, keeps the students on the roll. She's uh, increases learning rate of the students by ten percent. That's pretty good. Those are both bad. You board half as fast while teaching this teacher generates some mana points for their discipline. Hey, that's pretty good. You got a round belly. And, and you're a bit slow. Yeah, yeah. Baynard? Don't I already have a Baynard? Yeah, yeah. Come on in here, buddy. So you'll teach up there. We got a stable down this way. Uh, the fawn. I wonder maybe we should take the fawn over there. Now, a new school from a kingdom. How great. So very great. I would be very much like to help. I'm a fair and generous king. What do you need? So, a uh, king can give me gold, or the king can give me a card. I'll, I'll take a card. Janitor's Lodge supplies a janitor who cleans walls and, and the uh, the gra graffiti off the walls. we got an enchantment workshop that teaches us how to do enchantment things like alchemy. We've got some of that. Uh, we have an assassin's arena as well, which teaches us some assassination skills. Which, uh, I kind of want that one, but I think that would be good, because we already got some red. Let's, let's toss this over here. Where do we want to assassinate at? Let's do this. Like right next to that one. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of cool. Who wants to assassinate? We got, uh, you're a very good teacher. You're also chaotic good. No union. You're cheap. You're punctual. You're a light sleeper. You're demanding. You do, actually, I do pay you more. And you're voracious. Um, Mr. Yokai over here. You're, uh, you're, uh, so that, that you increase by 20%. You're by 10%. Lowers the learning rate by 10%. It's kind of bad. 
but but students learn 10% faster, so actually it cancels that out. While teaching this teacher may increase your reputation with Inquisition. Oh yeah, I was going to show that off here. Let me do that. I'm going to take oh, oh, Arya here because we get, because uh, she's a good teacher. So, um, the world. Let's take a look at the world. So we got we got my students here. We can see them where they're at. Some in general class, some in Kyorin. Uh, and what, what, what classes are we can change things around this way. Um, oh yeah, I have to hit escape, the X down here, which is ridiculous. Uh, we've got stats. We'll see those things. We'll see these these in just a second. Hold on, I'll show in a second. Prestige, students, employees, all that is there. Reputation. Um, we've got what we're uh, what we're learning here. We got a nature card play and yeah, all that kind of stuff. Um, and, and as far as like what's right, do we want to like balance it out or do we want to? Oh, there's a <laughs> what a classroom. Uh, let's go to the map. Okay. Here's Nook Quartz. So outside of Nook Quartz, there's a few folks around here. The Lord of Evil lives at the local cemetery. He likes us. We got five points for the lo Lord of Evil. If we hit 25 with the Lord of Evil, we get plus 10% shadow magic while we are studying at this school. So we want to make that guy happy. Um, the Inquisition Monastery, we can like, if, you know, we want to sort of uh, please or not please certain folks because they're the peasants. They don't like us. So if we get minus five again with the peasants, our teacher salary is going to go up by a lot. So keep an eye. We'll keep him happy. There's the king. We got the tavern up here as well. Occasionally we get attacked by things. We can send out a guinea pig to go uh, chat with these folks. We'll keep it how it is though. Uh, what do we have? What do, what do you want? Adventure Guild sends its regards. I found a window uh, between two troll massacres. Come say hi. The opening of a new magic school is always good news for an Adventurer's Guild. What kind of magic uh, do you train? So we can do uh, always in need of good healers, mages that blow things up, or mages that know how to use magical trinkets are useful too. Um, that's like light magic. Blow things up. Yeah, well, let's blow some things up. Yeah, yeah. So we got the Elemental Elementalist Dojo. There's an Elementalist, which is uh, which is the arcane deck. Uh, Demonic Chamber is Demonology. Oh, you know what? That's the one I don't have. Each each tier has each each school has three tiers. We don't have Demon Chamber. Yeah, I want it. Room is especially secured for Demon Summoning. Honestly, it is. I want that. So then we can go. Our nature school just really changed. Um, pop that up there. And who's going to teach demonology? Audrey? Troy Fleur? Who is uh, neutral, unionized. You're all unionized. You're good. You are... Students in his teacher class get bored half as fast. He's fun. They learn faster. He's, he's, he's fat. And uh, hunger lower. 30% slower while... Hmm? Oh. Okay. While he's eating. So yeah, he eats a lot. Bill? Um, Hawkeye uh, reduces all losses health by 20%. She's a bit clumsy. Chance to suffer from magical aberrations. I mean, what, what could possibly go wrong? We She's in the demon... <laughs> yeah, okay. The demonology room. <laughs> That's fantastic. Okay, there's the demonology room. Alright. Yeah, I like it. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot. I completely forgot about this. Each room has things... I told you there's a lot going on here. Um... So, chaotic students learn faster in the demonology room and also summoning forbidden. Studying this room has a chance of improving your relationship with the Lord of Evil. What a day. Alright, giant forest trail has been asleep for millennia. But your presence has disturbed his sleep. If your reputation from him falls to, to 100, he will awake and he won't be happy about it. That thing is huge. Okay, okay. We don't see him, do we? Nope, nope. I don't think so. He's just hanging around. Alright. Um, anyway... Oh, 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 tribe tribute. The orcs don't need much. And what we need, we can take from those weak humans. On the other hand, you could give us things directly, so we don't have to kill you first. That way, everyone wins. So we can give him 100 gold. He may, it gives his uh, tribe reputation bonus. Um, we can say, go away, minus 10. We can say, uh, we get attacked by four orcs. We have to fight them off. Well, there's not very many of us yet. Or our alchemists can craft things, but we don't have an alchemy mana for that. So, um, yeah, I'll pay you. Okay, you get out of here, orcs. We got three more students coming in. Uh, hop country act, allergic to crustaceans. You don't like alchemy? That's fine. That's fine. Count neutral. We are, you're rich. I like you. Give me some money. Uh, oh, what do you, we, we got a we got a deep folk. Repels the Lord of Evil's progress by a percentage equal to the prestige earned from their future. Uh, what's wrong with the Lord of Evil? We like that guy. You're brilliant. Oh yeah, yeah. I think you're probably pretty good to have here. Maybe. Actually, I don't know. Um, Dick Devil. Uh, a little ugly. I'll put you in general. Uh, let's make a new class. A new house. Um, well, I th 
maybe we do. Maybe we want to. Hmm. I don't know. Actually, I haven't had. I haven't had the, the luxury of having so much shadow in one spot. Maybe we have a specific nature. People. And and we just maybe we we do just a a, a specific like a new class, which is all uh, all shadow. I don't know. Oh, I should tell you guys. No shadow and no nature. Maybe we leave it as is. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I have the ability to do a new house, but I don't have any, you know, use of it. Let's get a new card. Here's alchemy. Classroom allows students to slowly improve all alchemy. Potions, ruins, uh, ruins, potions, and enchantments in that room. Student of the month portrait. This will, will give us a boost. Students that give them a modifier allows them to learn faster. Also get tired faster. We save it in one of the rooms or whatever. Shadow room allows students to improve their shadow... Uh, magic faster. Maybe do, do we go all shadow magic? Is that how we're gonna do this? Yeah, I think we are. I think I'm okay with that. All shadow all the time. Yeah. You can see the arrows, how they attach, so people can go. Uh, like pathfinding is, is an important thing here. So you have good wisdom. Uh, people also learn faster. You're a bit of uh, chaotic evil. You're a hypochondriac. You're also old. Um, I think uh, Noah Herminus is is the guy. So hang out up there and, and teach some things. There's some teaching going on over here already. Yeah, there's, there's a dead guy there. Hey, yeah, it happens. Um, yeah, I think here's what I'm going to do. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to arrange my houses a little different. So nature guys, you are no longer a shadow. I think I'm going to do no shadow. And in the new round of students, we're going we're gonna to make them all shadow. He has a pumpkin head. What happened? Aberration. Pumpkin. Learns half as fast, but no longer becomes hungry. Has a chance to disappear, or can be cured by the infirmary triggered by a study. Of, oh, he went and was studying, and he got a pumpkin head. Fantastic. So he has two levels in beast magic right now. He's only going to be here for seven years. So we got to get him trained up so that he graduates and becomes Archimedes. You know, whatever. Um, that's, the, that's the idea. We want to get him good and trained. But here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go in here. I'm going to make a new class that's all shadow. Oh, I really wish rich escape would hit that. Uh, let's make a, a, a shadow people. Okay, so shadow folks, you're going to be... I want something spooky. Spookier than a tree. Something good? An ant. Right. Oh, yeah, that's good. That's good. Um, no, no, no. That's, what is, that? is that like a, like a slot kind of thing? Mm -hmm. uh, let's go like yeah, that, and uh, maybe maybe a little bit of um, evil. I like that. And what color is the skull going to be? Red? bright red. Yeah, that, that's good. That's good. That's good. Um, I should have looked at this. I didn't. So, uh, this is randomized, obviously. So we could have made a you know, child of nature. And um, actually, you know what? Here's what I'm going to do. Because that other class has child of, of whatever the... Uh, has both child of nature and the, the, the shadow one. Maybe switch them all over into just shadow and then this guy is just going to be the all nature guy. It's going to be completely backwards because I made that already. Um, no, let's just do this. Let's do Diligent. And less Sanity, lowers Hunger, Comical, Reduce, bo reduce Boredom. You know, I think, you know, if, if you're going to study Shadow Magic, you got to have a sense of humor. It makes sense. There we go. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you're going to re-raise in Demons. You got you got Something's got to go. All right, let's go see if we can work on our nature deck here. So we can get a fawn, which I've got one I should use. The Sylvan's King's Horns. When a student is at least level 3 in Druidism, they get a Sylvan King's Horns. Hmm. Or the Fall Season Shoulder Pads. When a student is at least level 1 in Druidism and Herbalism, they get they get Shoulder Pads, and their health gains are now doubled. I already got a fawn. I'll take this. I don't know if I'm going to get Druidism, because I don't think I have, actually, a Druidism class, but this just seems cool. I'm going to put the fawn in. We'll toss him over here. Uh, where, where do you go, buddy? Where can you go? Oh, in there. All right, that works. So he'll hang around and makes people happy. Now I got more more mana we can spend. Let's spend some some demon mana. Active teachers in this room have a chance of creating component cards. There's an assassination, folks, and a grotesque statue. New students have a higher chance of being deep folk. Worship an alien entity as a god. Look, everyone needs a hobby. So I already have one of these things. This is I could just use this and I could bump mine up, make it better. Um, I don't know if I want to do the uh, component. Maybe come cards. The deep folk seems cool though. I'm gonna grab that. So can I put this in here? I'm gonna go there. Can I? Can I put it out there? I don't think I actually have a place to put it. Do I? 
No. Um, yeah, it's supposed to be in a room somewhere, but I don't have a place to put it. So I'm going to hold off on that. Can I get a... There's a private bedroom. There's a dorm. This allows two students to get some good rest. This is a dorm, which which has got five beds, and it gives us some decorations we can put in. This, for instance, is a uh, like a chest. Which I, don't have, I don't have any of those. Uh, here's a coffee machine we can put in a in a room as well. Um, I've got a dormitory. Can I put this in? Hmm. Yeah, I'll take the power. Whoops, did not mean to put it there. <laughs> can this count as an artifact? No, artifact is a sword thing. All right. Uh, let's get one more of these. Infernal Wings. Students uh, at least level 4 in Demonology and 3 in Necromancy gets Infernal Wings. There's a prison. There's a statue again. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. That seems like a, like a plan. Yeah, I like it. All right. Uh, orcs are hungry. Uh, got a new event. Human will find us something to eat. Otherwise, we'll eat the human and the small humans living in the human's house. We'll also eat the house that the human and small humans live in. Probably the human's pets, too, with some herbs and aromatics. I advise you to eat the neighboring village. <laughs> uh, so I got nothing to, they make them mad uh, if I had any of this stuff I could I would do it I need a health risk waffle maker huh? um, I would <laughs> I would advise you to eat the humans this is a bad idea but please go eat the humans chosen by the light your plus one light magic I'm going to put you in general because you're chatty and I don't like that you're brilliant though so I'll put you in general shadow of nature no one is, is in this yet so I need some people in there. But you are a child of nature. you got to be in the nature one. Jack of all trades. Child of nature. And you're a werewolf. Come on, somebody. Chosen by the light. Uh, all right. You know what, buddy? I don't care about you. like the light? Well, get in the demon classes because we got one person doing that and we have a ton of stuff. Okay. Looks like they're still continuing their classes, though, so it's okay. They're still, you know, gaining me some mana here for the uh, for the demon magic. That's That's all right. So, um, also we have a, oh, by the way, we have a headmaster's office. We're not done yet. So, first we got two things we can look at in here. We've got this, which is basically our rules. Do we, do we allow men and women? Do we allow, what kind of discipline do we have? Um, poor discipline, they get, they, they just misbehave more, but they get bored slower. Uh, we can get a sponsor. We gain gold every season, but lose a bit of prestige. Um, organize yearly contests between houses. Students learn 10% faster, but recover from tiredness. Oh, yeah, yeah, let's do that. That seems cool. Um, we can pick who we want. Only wealthy families, which gives us more gold. Um, application costs money. Well, we'll make them pay for the, um... Rent some money from students when they use dormitories, but they are less effective. Um, we'll leave how... I got gold right now. We'll leave how it is. How much we're paying our teachers and meals. So, yeah, we'll do that. We also have this, which is sort of if, if and when people graduate, we will see their names popping up in here. But that is my headmaster's office. And, uh, yeah, there's a ton going on here. Uh, I need some new students. So, hey, we got a goblin. Or, sorry, half-orc. Half-orc. Well, I'm not as excited as I thought I was going to be. Arcane Scholar. You really like arcane magic. Uh, 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 Goldpark. You're going to be a, a, a demon raiser. You learn shadow magic slower, so you will not do that one. What's this? Contest of the Houses Recover. Oh, that's that. So, I'll put you in this one. And... Light Sleeper. You're also a half orc. It's fifty forty percent faster. Forty percent faster in rooms with an animal and need there needs growth twenty percent with an animal, like dead animals. You really want to be in the nature room, don't you? Why does everyone want to be nature? It makes sense. I'm in the forest. Um, he's a bit slow. Um, I do want to put you in here though because I need more of these guys. Let's get some more. Oh, how much of these? Two fifty for a new deck uh, of those. Let me grab one more of these. Arcane Room for some of that. Shadow Room is another one of those for uh, Necromancy, Demo Demonology, and, and Assassination. We forgot one of those. We would just upgrade the one we've got. We could do this to allow a bit of arcane magic coming in. I'm not opposed to that. We could also upgrade this. Students are sure to find the animals they summon in Druidism class on their plates. With a good prep <laughs> pepper and anchovy sauce. Um, I haven't tried this before. I'm going to see what happens if we upgrade this. What'd that do? Evolution level 1, efficiency bonus plus 10%. Okay, okay, I get it. You guys are hungry again? Look, go eat the village. 
And these orcs are going to be a problem, and the village is going to really hate me. Where is it? Yeah, mine is 50. Okay, yeah, they really hate me. So does the king. Students are poor on average because the king hates me. You oh, dang orcs. They kind of like me. Students generate more natural mana when studying there. So we get 10 more there. They would like us a lot. Uh, can we go chat with the um, these guys? Uh, actually, let's, let's talk with the cemetery. Let's see what we can get over there. Meeting with the Lord of Evil. Have you come to beg for mercy? These two vampire princes are talking to the Lord of Evil's throne. They seem to be arguing about their progeny's magical abilities. Um... Yes, we have. Uh, reputation goes up plus five. Forget it, I'm leaving. Oh, wait, we got, oh, I can't do anything else. Have a coffin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plus one. That's, that's fine. Okay, I'll take some more of this stuff. A marsh vulture. Lowers the sanity of good students, but teaches necromancy and demonology. Well, breastplate. Uh, once we hit two in assassination and one in druidism, they get a, they get a breastplate. You now gain one reputation point with the orcs. Each time they gain a shadow magic level. Hmm. Interesting. I already have one of those. Uh, can I put this guy out here somewhere? Yeah, let's put him... What did, he, what did he do? Lowers the sanity of good students, but teaches necromancy and demonology. So he could put... He, oh, you know what? He has to go in here. Let's, yeah, pop in there, buddy. So there he is. So he actually sits in there. He's actually going to improve their, uh, their, their, their stats. I'm actually thinking I'm going to do this. Because they are kind of, you know... Yeah. I think that's probably better. Focus on nature, but you know what? If there's a you know a little demon raisin comes upon them, you know, you can do some of that too. Okay, so people are gonna head home. Uh, basically, what's going on here is is they will go and eat and sleep and whatever. If, as long as their needs are met, they're happy. If if they aren't met, they'll leave and they'll go home, which which takes time. It's time to create a specific teaching goals. We should put a cur curriculum together so our students end up with great futures. What would you like to create? So we can go with Dragon Slayer. Students tra train a student for this future. Focus on beast magic and retribution. Android master is herbalism. Uh, so I don't want to do either of these. I guess we're going to go be. I guess we'll have to do this one. Beast magic and retribution. So I'll have to get some light magic in here somewhere. Out of room. We already got to go with those. Alchemy. Bedroom. I don't want this. I want. Hmm. Do this again. What is their private bedroom, I guess? Yeah, up there. Yeah, you know, for the for the you know the necromancers, they, they can have their own bedroom. Gluten-filled refectory. You have such little respect for your students that you do not even care to offer a gluten-free meal, let alone a vegan one. It is so surprising. After all, so many come to me. Uh, I don't. I don't. Um, I don't have the ability to do any of this stuff because I don't have any nature or alchemy magic. So, um, or uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't care about gluten. I don't even know what it is. All right, Leonard. Unbreakable. You don't like the libraries? Okay, welcome to the uh, Tetsuero one. Okay, magic faster. Um, Bruce Dobby could go into general for the for the arcane scholar. No, I think it, oh, you can go in there. That seems, seems useful. I mean, we've got the school for it, so it should be good. Speaking of, anyone uh, like anyone good at things? You guys have been here for a little while. You have any stats? You got two in uh, in necromancy, which I have forbidden. How are you doing? How are you learning that? Everyone has. You got. Oh, you're new. Um, let's see. Some of you guys. You got a one there. Anyone? Anyone have any good? Oh, there's a three in necromancy. Old Teddy here. Okay. Okay. We're get, we're getting there. Anybody? Any of you black robe folks have any uh, skills yet? No. It looks like a lot of them. They're getting sort of. Filled up like like old Humra has uh, has a little bit of everything here. So okay, we're getting there. Um, I need to call it a day. So I'm getting kind of I'm getting kind of absorbed in here. Uh, there's somebody hanging out. There's old old there's old Bruce Dobby. I was just talking about you, Bruce. Didn't you just you just showed up, didn't you? You only here for three years. Okay, I need a special magic discipline to specialize in. Yeah, so we're not gonna do arcane magic. Light specialists, alchemy, or or no nature. I know some people think it's uncool, but I like natural magic. I really want. I need. I need some better luck here with my uh, my draws, and uh, get some more shadow magic because that's what we got. Um, these things popping up, we can make them come faster. My adventurers, friends, and I are, are back from the battlefield. We won, but I slipped on the way back and slashed my leg. Can you do something? Um, uh, it's not that bad. You're fine. That's the, that's, the, that's the Adventurer's Guild, by the way. 
Uh, Shadow Disciple. It's about time. Jay, smile, buddy. Okay, and uh, and that's about it. That's that's. Um, oh, we can get some of this. Let's see what we got. Herbalist boards. Doctor students in this room get herbalism. There's a greenhouse for herbalism, and we have a dolmen, a classroom that allows students to quickly improve their druidism skills. Yeah, we're gonna go like there just to have like a walkway because it's kind of neat. Uh, under the king's protection, this teacher may increase your protection with a king. Oh, that might that might be good. Job lover. Yeah. Reduces boredom growth. He loves his job. I mean, that's kind of nice, but... This guy loves his job. Walter? I don't know how you say your last name. Come on in. So they go. Now Now they can go... Actually, is that closed off? No, there's a room there. So they can go through this. All the way through here. Alright, I'm going to call it a day here. So this is Spellcaster University. Uh, if I don't stop now, I, I won't. But uh, there's a lot going on. And... This is just the first... Uh, level school basically no one's even learning how to be a be an assassin over here uh vegetable embargo uh school is dangerous whenever they get too close to it their cows fall sick some give birth to two-headed lambs which are in case don't realize isn't good we'll not be selling you any vegetables until it stops well that's not very nice students and teachers no longer take longer to eat now come on buddy uh, that's not very nice uh you can go in there um, anyway, I'm going to call it a day. So, thanks for watching. Uh, I'll put links to the Steam page below, and you can check it out. And I will see you next time.